Hey guys, I'm Christina. Oh, no, that didn't work. Yeah, there's a bouncy ball where I tried to spin. Whatever. Twas a good day today for me. Why was it a good day, Christina? Because I got to use the word twas. Actually, there were many reasons why today was a good day, and I'm going to explain them to you in video format. <laughs> that was cool. Okay, one. I went to, I'm not even going to try counting this video. Just kidding, because I'm so bad at counting and staying focused. What was I talking about? Oh, sorry. So today I went to my sister's graduation. Two of my sisters graduated from college, which was pretty exciting. If Dan Brown had finished college, I bet they would know him. I'm so jealous. Anywho, so I went to their graduation, and although it was really, really long, I brought like a book and like goldfish and a Lipton green tea. I love that stuff. Anywho, although it was really, really long, there were a lot of hot guys there, and I was just like, I candy. I was so happy. And then when we were walking in there, there was this guy in front of me, right? And he had a shirt on. Duh. Well, <laughs> Anywho, uh, he had this really cool shirt and I was like, oh, hug, because he looked like a good person to hug. And then I was like, must resist urge to hug, but I did resist and I was very proud, which is a good thing because I was right by my aunt and my dad and that would have been awkward. Plus he didn't know me. And then after we got back in town because my sisters graduated not where I live, we went to a store, I think it was Baker's, and there in the parking lot, I walked into a parked car. I think that was the first time I've ever fully walked into a parked car. Like, I've, I've bumped it, but, like, this was a whole boom, ow. <laughs> why did I do that? Oh, why would I reenact that? Ow. Oh, bad. I walked into a parked car, and I was very, very happy that the alarm didn't go off. Because <laughs> I would have been just a little bit embarrassed then. I like how I'm not embarrassed to walk into a parked car. I just, whatever. <laughs> and then... At um, Michael's, there was this Jeep, right? Crazy, right? I know. And it had a smiley face on the back like Jeeps do, and then it had Don't Worry, Be Happy. And then when we got into Michael's, the song was playing, and I was like, oh, it's magic. I was excited. And then there, I got friendship bracelet string, and I was very excited, because I like doing those. And everyone in my school is bombarding me, and they're like, make me one, and I was like, okay. Hi. I'm really hyper. But then, this is the best part of the video. So excited that I'm getting closer to you and almost falling out of my chair. <gasps> Ow, that hurt. Mm -mm. But I was very excited, because there, guess what I found? Oh, I'm so excited, because I just can't even believe myself. Okay, so, at my school, they have these lockers, right? Really, I know. And this girl had a Harry Potter coloring thing on a locker. And I was like, where did she get that? I want it. Today, guess what I found? A Harry Potter coloring book for $6. Oh my god, my mom even let me buy it. I was so excited. I was like, OMG, huh? I don't even know what to do, though, because I'm so excited and I love this so much that I want to start coloring in it right away, but I'm almost afraid to because then if I color it, I can't color it again. Dilemmas, dilemmas. Anywho. And then I went to... Hi, desk. And then I went to Borders because I had to work on a PE project for my final with uh, one of my friends. Yeah, I have friends. <laughs> and so they had free Wi-Fi there, and I was like, let's go there. And she's like, okay. And so I went there, and I was like, mm, books, resist. And I did <laughs> for a while. But before she got there, I was looking at the magazines, and I was like... Oh, I miss the days where Johnny Depp was on the cover of all these magazines. And then I drank root beer, and I was happy. And then, at the end, you know, we finished the project, well, didn't finish it, yeah, right. We got some of it done, and she left, you know, because blah, 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 and I was waiting for my mom. And I was looking at the books, and I was like, I'm really bored, because I can't have any of these books, and I don't have time to read any of these books, and I want these books, I need the books. And then I got really bored, because I was, like, crying, because I couldn't have the books, right? I know. You know you love it. That wasn't weird. Nom nom nom. Hello, brush. You're my best friend. Am I still recording? I really hope so. Oh, good. I am still recording. Yay! So I was looking at all the books, right? Duh, I just explained the books and whatever. You're done with the books. And I was bored and I was, and I was bored at Borders. Ha <laughs> ha. Sorry. And then I remembered something. Duh. The in your pants joke. If you're not familiar with it, the In Your Pants joke is where you add In Your Pants to the end of book title, movie title, song name, whatever your little heart desires, and it becomes amazingly entertaining, and it's so much fun. So here are some In Your Pants jokes that I found really funny. Happy In Your Pants. Caught In Your Pants. 
fired up in your pants? The keys to the kingdom in your pants. <laughs> I really like that one. The finishing touches in your pants. I have a feeling my dad's gonna walk in here. Ooh, I'm gonna get yelled at. Great expectations in your pants. You've only just begun in your pants. You've only just begun in my pants. That's not awkward. Stupid white men in your pants. And I have to say, this one's my favorite. The duel in your pants. <laughs> I don't even want to know how that goes. So yeah, that kind of made my life. And then after we went to Porter, my mom finally picked me up. Oh, we went by McDonald's because she wanted a Diet Coke, and then they were out of Diet Coke, and I was like, that sucks. She's so addicted. Anywho, there was a fence on top of McDonald's on the roof, and I was like, why is there a fence? <laughs> it was a good day for me. I really liked today. I hope today was wonderful to you, and if it wasn't, then I hope tomorrow is better. I love you so much. Thank you for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. I'm never going to call it a thumbs up. It's just, oh. I'm so happy. I love you so much. Goodbye. That was weird.